channel. If you're new here, my name is Carly. Welcome. Um, in today's video, I'm going to be doing a spring makeup look. I decided to do this because it is spring, even though we're all stuck inside. It's just nice. Do a bit of makeup. Make yourself feel better, really. So, yeah, this is what I'm doing. In spring, I don't really wear like foundation. So, um, I've got like only a handful of products that I would wear in spring when it's like spring or summer I have a lot of freckles on my face like the majority of my face is covered in freckles so I like to show them off you know I don't want to cover them up and also gives my chance my skin a chance to breathe to be honest because in the winter I'm wearing it so everyone the first step in my minimal look why well, I keep calling it minimal <sighs> Everyone, my first step in my spring makeup look is um, a hydrating or a, you know, dewy primer kind of cream, whatever. Um, I have a few, but today I decided to use the MAC strobe cream. So what I do with this is I will just, oh, let me open my mirror up. So what I do with this is I just like squeeze a little bit onto my fingers I've not got a lot left of it but it's been lasting me ages I just squeeze about this much onto my finger and I just like pat it onto like the high points of my cheeks and then I just like rub it in really I also work it into my brow bone too just to make myself look like I've got a lot of natural, glowy, you know, this going on. Yeah, it just gives me a lot of like natural glowiness. And then when I put like the um, highlighter on top, it makes me look real like glowy and looks like I've just, you know, had a summer glow. Because us pale girls don't get a lot of glow, so we have to improvise with things. Also, um, if I want some more, just get a little bit more and I just like rub it between my fingers, like that. Rub a bit on my nose just to give that bit of a glow because obviously your nose gets, my nose is obviously um, a bit red because I burnt it like a few days ago. Just put a bit like, under my lip, above my lip, put some on the inner corners of my eyes. I sometimes wear this just on its own if I don't feel like wearing a highlight like if i wear like a really minimal makeup where i just wear like my eye like my eye mascara my eyebrows and i'll wear this just because it, it still gives me that glow that i need because you know we can't all glow from within can we my next step is um concealer today i'm using the nars radiant creamy concealer um i'll just put the concealer in places that i need it because obviously when I'm not wearing foundation, I don't need it all over my face. Because when I'm wearing foundation, I use it to cover up the redness. Whereas in spring, summer, my face is... Oh! <coughs> my voice went then. Um, in spring, summer, my face is red anyway all day. Because, you know, I when I get, you know, a tan, my skin is more like a burnt tomato rather than golden goddess look. So... I just think I've got to embrace the red. So what I do is just apply it under my eyes only a little bit. If I've got any problem areas, like any spots or anything, I'll apply it on them. At the moment, I don't have any, which is brilliant. I mean, I don't put any anywhere else because I don't want to cover up my freckles or anything. And then I just tap it out of my finger. Brilliante. <laughs> right, so once that's um, all tapped in, in this makeup tutorial i don't add powder to my under eyes so the next step is um gonna be my favorite favorite step not um is my eyebrows they've got even worse um so just ignore them because um i can't pluck them into the shape i want because i'm that great so i've just been plucking a few little stray bits and you know the shape ain't brilliant, but it's what it's what I've got to deal with. What I'm using for my eyebrows is the Benefit Browsings um, in shade 3. I use this in my everyday makeup tutorial. And the brush I'm using is the MAC 
266 brush. So just get a bit of the gel like that. And then yeah, just like start carving out my eyebrows to be honest. But I don't have too much though because I ain't going out for a glam night. I'm just going out for a, you know, it could be like a meal. Do you know what I mean? So I can't be doing it too heavy now. <laughs> a bit of the uh, powder just to the ends of my eyebrows just a little bit now I'm doing the same with the other eyebrow there we go eyebrows done I mean I ain't happy with the way they look but you know we move can't do nothing about it everyone the next step is gonna be oh oh I forgot my eyelash curler what a numpty. The next step is going to be, I think, a blusher or a bronzer. Depends how I'm feeling on the day. I will use a bronzer or blusher. The bronzer I've got here is the Hoola Bronzer by Benefit. And then the blusher I have is the Ultimate Blush Palette by Revolution in the shade sugar and spice sometimes i use it both but only a little bit i made my mind up right so i'm going to start off with a bronzer because i like using a bronzer all over my face whereas the blusher i can only use about on my cheek things right so i'm going to use yeah the who the bronzer by benefit and i'm using the mac 135 brush with it it's a nice fluffy brush so i just like swirl the product in there and tap it off a little bit not too much because my mum will get mad <laughs> um, and then what I do is I just like make that face and suck the cheeks in you right, dad? Right. come in we've got sausages, you want sausage and mash? Um, sure <laughs> Yeah, I love that. I love sausage and mash. All right. All right, thanks, Dad. So, that is um, my bronzer done. As you can see, I just like applying it very lightly. And then what I do is, I put a little bit on my nose. Now, I use the brush it comes with to do that. So this is the little brush it comes with, little, uh, little blue fluffy brush. What I do is, I just like dab it in there like once or twice like that like to add a bit of bronziness because it ties all the face together i just like to do this bit here it look like that a little bit of colour and then a little bit of nice little bit of highlight there so I look like I've actually been bronzed by the gods um, you know I've been given some of that goddess glow wonderful so that's bronzer done now the little bit of blush so the blush palette I'm using as I said is a revolution one and it has so many shades in it but I think what I'm gonna do is I'm just gonna like run the blush the blush a brush along the ones I like mainly I like that one to be honest but I thought I was gonna run my brush through it and just see what happens to be honest if I like the result, then absolutely fantastic. Also guys, a tip that I learned when I was watching makeup artist Wayne Goss is to not put your blush here because when you smile, it's up. Then when you don't smile, it goes down. So, you know, the blush you had there is just going to make your face look like dragged down. Whereas if you apply it here where I'm applying it, everything's, you know, up. So it makes, you know, your face look more up. I don't know. That's what he was saying. It's like about making your face look up. But yeah. And also I prefer it here. Just because it gives me that look. And there we go, guys. You can see the blusher. It gives a little bit of a nice, you know, nice rosy glow kind of effect. But obviously just not slapped there. Just like blended into the cheeks. And step is gonna be highlighter so today I've decided that I'm gonna be using this girls of attitude highlighting palette it's called the sweet crush highlighting palette I won this in a competition actually I entered for a youtuber I watched called Lucy flight and um, 
yeah, I won like a whole like bundle of like beauty skincare um, bits. I won a hair dryer as well. Um, and this came with it and I love it, you know. Comes with four shades like this. The shades are called Honeycomb, Peach Fizz, Cotton Candy and Sugar Icing. Oh no, my camera's flashing again. <sighs> right, so the shade I'm going to use, oh, the brush I'm using is the Sigma High Cheekbone Highlighter FO3 brush. The shade I'm going to be using is Cotton Candy. And then I just like to apply it where I've applied the um, strobe cream in like little sweepy motions. As you can see, it's giving me a very nice glowy highlight. <laughs> then what I do is I just get my finger, my ring finger, this one, and just put it in that, tap it once, tap it off, and just go like in there in the corner of my eye, another tap for the other eye, that just gives me a nice, you know, nice little bit glow, I had a bit there, as I said, but only a touch. Yeah, so that's me eyeliner done, bosh. My next step is going to be mascara, eyelash curlers. Okay, so what I'll do first is I'm going to curl my eyelashes. apply oh that um eyelash colours from skinny dip by the way got it in the secret center um then eye mascara i don't know why i keep calling it eye mascara it's just mascara ain't it don't go anywhere else um is the lancome hip nose drama i got this in a present from my friend oh i got it somewhere again oh, typical typical way can't do it right ever. Can't just not get it anywhere, can I? I have to be a mess. There we go. So, this is a very dramatic mascara, as you can see. Very dark and, you know, like, whoa. The last step to me, um, spring makeup is to add a lip gloss. I like, I prefer wearing lip glosses because they just add to the glowy look, you know what I mean? And it just looks quite... Uh, Naturale. Oh yes, so the lip gloss I'm going to be using is by Fenty Beauty and it is the shade Fussy, well, F-U dollar sign dollar sign Y. So, I love this lip gloss, it's very nice and nice, and it's got such a lovely smell, nice. Perfect. Yeah, I love this lip gloss, stays on long, it's got it's not like sticky, you know like some crushes you're putting lips together and it's like oh I can't put, bring them apart when it's like sticky I love it and it stays on long lots of glossy power and a beautiful smell that's my spring makeup look complete everyone hope you um, like it so hope you've all enjoyed it do not forget to subscribe to my channel like this video and share it with your family and friends and also leave any comments um, down below if you use any products or you've got any product recommendations for me to try yeah just let me know if you try the look out to be honest I mean similar products will work obviously but yeah just hope you have a nice week and yeah enjoy life I'll see you on my next video, guys. Bye.